Hey guys, On the Edge Survival here. This is Andrew. I'm going to show you how to shoot an azimuth. Is that an azimuth is nothing more than a degree. There are 360 degrees in a circle, and so there are 360 degrees in a map in an azimuth. Now, an azimuth is nothing but a direction. It's not a distance. Just a direction that you need to travel. Now, <clears throat> in order to do this, you need to have two points on a map, minimum. You can have multiple, you can shoot multiple azimuths between the two points, but you need an azimuth, shooting azimuth is a direction between two points. Now, on a map, it can be done with any type of map. This, I have just, I just printed off on a computer a minutes ago, you done with a road map, it can be done with any type of map that you've acquired in, in a in the world situation or whatever type of map, as long as the map uh, has a true north, south, west, and east. It's all you gotta worry about for this. Now, you'll need a protractor and a compass. I'll show you the compass in a minute, but this is a protractor. The second line right there is your azimuth. These numbers will line up with your compass later on. Now, how you do this is once you find out where you're at in the map, that's our point A, you'll place this protractor over over point A. That's 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 what you need to do. Point A, right there. Now get your protractor as straight with your map as possible. A couple of degrees it can be a too this ain't gonna be a too big deal, but get as straight as possible. Now what I've done is I've drawn a line from point A to point B. You can also do this by tying a rope through the hole of the protractor and have it swivel and then you can take it to your point B in order to give you the same azimuth. This azimuth on this I'd say it's about 288 wouldn't y'all? About 288. Now we're gonna go outside and we're gonna show you how to shoot a 288 azimuth on our compass. Okay? Okay this part can be done with any compass that has an azimuth on it. This is a military comp military style compass. Uh, it ranges about forty fifty dollars, uh, but you can also but you can also find a compass at Walmart. It's a black plastic compass, about twenty bucks, and it has an azimuth on it. Now, what an azimuth is on a compass is the same thing you saw on your protractor, but it's actually in a circle, and they're red. <laughs> so. Now, our azimuth inside was a 288, wasn't it? Okay. How you set this up, and you need to have a compass that has something, has a feature like this. You can shoot an azimuth without this, but it's extremely difficult. All you do is you place your eyepiece under the lid, under the, under the, under the lid of your compass. Stick your thumb to the to the bottom of it and hold it. Hold it level. Now, as you can see, our our azimuth is currently sitting at about a hundred. Now, in order in order to find our this is for direction. Now, in order to find 288, we just turn around and right about there. About 288. Now, once you have your asthma set at 288, you look through this people. That wire right there. That wire can be set on a feature up ahead, whether it be a tree, a building, whatever it is. That that wire right there can be set on a feature up ahead. Now, when you look through it, you look you you fix your wire on that building and you walk toward that building or tree or feature or whatever it is. Once you get there, you go around the side and do the same thing. Shoot your azimuth. Already off a little bit. Shoot your azimuth again. Look through your people, line your wire up with a feature up ahead and walk toward it. And you do this until you get to your location that you want. And that is how you shoot an azimuth on a compass.